Hey guys, welcome to The Mortuary Assistant. This is a horror game that was just fully released last week, so we decided to check it out over the course of multiple live streams on Twitch. In this game, you get to play as Rebecca, who was just hired to be a mortuary assistant, but not everything is as it seems in this mortuary. It was absolutely terrifying, and it ended up being one of the scariest horror games I've played in quite some time. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started, and I hope you enjoy. But here we go. I'm kind of terrified, to be honest. I'm so and hello, squirrel! Oh, there's... Congratulations, sweetie. <laughs> Thank you. I'll never understand why you chose such a macabre feel, There's nothing but... disturbing about it. It's just but that it... I'm proud of you. I really am. You've come so far. So, you haven't told me what's next. Will you get a job where you are, or...? They actually have everyone they need. But my old teacher, Mr. Delver, transferred me to his office to finalize my internship there. Oh, well, that's good. I remember you mentioning him. Where's he located? Are you moving away from me? <laughs> no. No, I'm not moving. Possessive. He's actually located around here. River Fields. Oh, oh, Rebecca. I don't like that. Grandma. Even I've heard things about that place. Just be worried people about you. People make up stories. Death is a scary thing to a lot of people. And we try to explain things we don't understand, and we want comfort when we lose someone we love. I mean, no one's embalming any ghost bodies or whatever. It's fine. All right, all right. I'm sorry. But I wanted to give you this anyway. So, here. It's cursed. I, I don't know if I want that. Just take it, please. It's cursed. It should be yours anyway. Yeah, it's definitely Wait. cursed. Don't touch it. Wait. All right. Enough spooky stuff. I'm so proud of you. When is all this happening? When do you start? I've actually been there for a few weeks now. My review is tomorrow. Uh oh. There's an emergency. Someone just died. Also, her lip game or her lipstick game is strong. I love that shade. But anyways, I bumped up the audio just a little bit, so still let me know if it needs any more adjusting. First object located. <laughs> Wait, what's wrong with Connecticut? I thought Connecticut was a nice place. I've only been there once for like a day, so I can't really say, but <laughs> their eyes are a little funky, but other than that, actually the hair's a little weird too, but. I'll, I'll forgive it because lipstick looks wonderful. All right. All right, it's good. Go. Okay. The way she grabbed it. Yeah, I was going to say, like, that looked really weird. <gasps> what the heck? Okay. All right. Can I? Oh, I wasn't. I was going to say, I'm like, I'm not moving, but apparently the game was. Okay. Uh, sensitivity is a bit too strong. Hang on. Let's dial that down. Resume. Resume. Please? Okay. Alright, that feels a little better. What's this? Okay. I can just... Yeet! <laughs> well, I thought it was gonna break, but apparently it's a rubber vase, actually. Okay, that's where it lives now. Why do you have this? This is creepy. This is creepy. Connecticut's, Connecticut's fine, you just have to give it shit. Really? Why? That is my question. Why do you have to give it shit? Also, the table jiggles when I do this. Jiggle, 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 jiggle. And I... Oh, I can open. Okay. <gasps> oh, that's nice, too. It's not a drag. I just click. That is wonderful. Thank you, game developers, for including that. I hate it when I have to drag them, to be completely honest. I Because I'm lazy. Oh, a pencil. Used to sign the paperwork left at the door. Okay, I can do that. Oh, oh. Quick inventory. Access quick inventory and choose the item you wish to use. Most, but not all, places where items can be used will cause the use item use item icon to appear. Okay, right mouse button. Oh. So this one? Ah! Ah! Alright, so we sign this. Or look at that. One last thing I forgot to give you. Please grab a pencil from my desk and sign. Thanks. P.S. Good luck. I don't want your luck. That scares me. I already got the pencil. I already got it. I'm pretty sure I need to use the- Oh. No, the door just opens. 
<gasps> oh, I tried to click and drag, didn't I? Rebecca, great, perfect time. Hi, who are you? I just finished with Mr. Oh, Dog Raymond. Here. Please wheel him back to cold storage and Ooh. bring us Mrs. Page. There's a body, guys. Moving the deceased. Use the gurney by standing behind it and pressing the gurney interact key. All right, then walk backwards with the gurney down the hall. Ah, do you think I'm supposed to go right here? Oh. You're not looking so good. Okay. We're just gonna drag this back. We're off to a strong start. Oh, whee! I could, okay. Cold storage. To bring a body in or out of cold storage, open the bay with the body's name, pull out the rack, and then move the cart over to it. Alrighty then. That that makes sense to me. Okay. Come here. Where, where do I need to take you? This one? Left mouse button. I'm, I, there we go. So that one you do have to click and drag. Okay. Now I, here, take the body. <laughs> that actually works. I'm not a vampire, exactly. Okay. There, is there another body somewhere? Okay, uh, do it, do you push it? Oh, I see. Pull that out. Okay, okay. Guys, I'm doing wonderful. First day on the job is going amazing. And then we push that back in. Hey, okay, bye! Oswald. Oh. I did it. Okay, why... Am I... Okay, pick that up. Hi, Dorothy. Uh, da, da, da. Let's see. Would it be better to pull her out first? Let's try it this way. My first body turns out to be the crib keeper. <laughs> uh, use Ernie? Can I, can I please? Oh, there it goes, okay. There we go. Come here, come here, Dorothy. Oh, God, oh, thank heavens she's wearing a bra. Oh. Okay. Ugh. We're all already off to a great start. I'm already getting squeamish. Her eyes look really creepy, like A plus to the devs. Like those eyes, ooh. Ooh. Yeah, I deserve a raise, I agree. You wanna be able to do this job in real life? Bodies aren't your thing? Uh, same. Can I, can I like turn? Pivot, pivot, <laughs> pivot. <laughs> okay, the pivoting system is a little funky, but it's okay, I figured it out, let's go. Maybe. <gasps> oh wait, body has to be facing th that way. I figured it out, I figured it out. That's kind of weird. I thought we had to pull it down, so that means I have to pivot. Pivot the other way. <laughs> pivot, pivot. It's like that scene from Friends. Okay, got it. Take it one's feet first. Yep, yep, yep. I got it. I got it. I figured it out. It took me a minute. I was too busy laughing. <laughs> All right, I'm just finishing up something here. So why don't you grab the clipboard and start recording identifying okay. marks? I'll get out of your way when you're done and let you hop in here. Sounds good. Okay, clipboard used for forms and keeping track of mortuary tasks. Ah, large item. I see. So, Dorothy Page, 87. She has all her limbs. Perfect. All right, well, let's, let's, let's do this. Examine. Inspecting a body. Hover the cur cursor over unique markings such as moles, scratches, bruises, and interact with them to record them to the clipboard. Awesome. Ah, ah, this is getting uncomfortable. What do, we let's see. Can I, whoops, no, stop that. I was gonna say, can I like touch the body or no? Okay. Anything? Oh, rotate. What can I rotate? Oh God, I could rotate her arm. Oh look, there's a thing. Okay, put that back. Ugh. Ah, <laughs> just poke. Just, uh. excuse me. These old windows never stay latched. I don't know, sir. That seems suspicious. Okay, let's get the fresh air back in here, though. It's a it's a beautiful day. Look at that. Can I crouch? Oh, yes, I can. Quick, guys, we can escape. All right. We want the birds chirping while we're examining the dead body. Oh. What am I rotating? Oh. Okay, there's a thing. She's got a mole right here. Sus. <laughs> Anything else? I don't think so. Uh, let's look at her dead eyes. Oh god. I don't I don't want to rotate. I actually don't. Hi. 
Let's see, is that anything? No? Okay. Oops, rotate back. Ugh. But it's the eyes that get me. Okay, I think that's all good. Nothing weird going on here. Uh, back, please. Get away from the eyes. Ugh. What's this? Excuse me, I- the, Can I not? I feel like those are marks. How come I can't- Okay, guess they're not important marks. My bad. Yep, rotate that hand, please, and thank you. Okay, there's an, a laceration, I believe is what they call it in the biz. Sussy. <gasps> Great. Climb on in here and put everything into the record system. Don't forget to take the printout to the front desk so Zoe can add it to the package so for the family. After that, we'll get started. What do you mean, we'll get started? I already started. I just examined a whole body. But sure, I'll get on in here. All right. Riverfield's network how-to. To enter cadaver information, click the record system icon. What was that? What? I didn't say anything. You all right? Y yeah. What? I'm fine. Sorry. What? Um, guys, I'm hearing whispers. Uh, I'm assuming that's a good sign, yes? <laughs> Climb into my desk. Laceration or abrasion, not sure which one it is. Looks like it could be either. <laughs> we are not all right, absolutely not. That was creepy. Okay, click the record system icon to open the program. Match the sections on my clipboard to the corresponding sections on the computer. Once all findings have been entered into the system, click submit to print out the embalming records. Then file the records up front to begin the embalming. Oh, so that's what we're beginning, okay. Night shift. Ugh. Okay, record system. Got name. Do I have to actually like type it in? Oh, I just circle it. Gotcha. Okay. Age is 87. Head. There's nothing to report. Let's see. Right shoulder. We got rash and a mole. Right arm is mild abrasion. Ah, this one is a, an abrasion. It actually... Oh, actually, no. The one on the, the hand was a contusion. Ah, ah, gotcha, and left leg is a blemish, okay, is that, is that it? I think that's it, did I do it? Contusion equals bruise, you think? Maybe it's a Maroi? <laughs> oh no, it's beeping at me, what did I, what did I miss? It's Dorothy, okay, wait, I already did that, why didn't it enter it? Sus. Th I did it! I definitely already clicked on those, but sure. Okay, back. I printed it. Oh. Hi. Can you stop staring at me, actually? You're kind of freaking me out. Okay, embalming report. A packet of mortuary pa paperwork related to the handling of the deceased. File up front so they are available if requested. Awesome. Uh, it's not a wraith, guys. Look, we got footsteps. Amber does paperwork. I won! That was it. That was the game. Okay, I uh, put it... Embalming report. Got it? Okay, time to embalm. Here we go, guys. Alright. I've set everything out so you can just go ahead and get started. I'll be monitoring. From way over there? Everything's on your list there if you need it. Wouldn't it make more sense for you to walk over here and actually, you know, monitor? Okay. Uh, wire jaw sh- Oh, there's an order! Okay. Wire jaw shut with needle injector and settings needle. Okay. Uh, put away. No, put it away. How about you? I can't use that here. Okay, but can I drop it? <laughs> He's just gonna watch, creepy. He looks like a disappointed golf instructor. I got a scalpel. It's used for surgery. That makes sense. Okay, which one's... I wish they would tell me which one is the needle that I need. I'm going to assume... What is this? Artery forceps used for grasping and compressing an artery. Ah. Record used for injecting cavity fluid directly into organs. Okay, so that goes with the IV bag probably. Uh, flexible, durable tubing used for various medical applications. Okay, I can't pack that one up yet, because, uh, I still got things. Okay, needle injector tool used for ha hammering setting needle barbs into the skull. 
That that description makes me uncomfortable. I guess we'll take that. Oh, I don't like eye caps. Eye caps. <laughs> Used for holding eyelids shut. Okay, well, at least you won't be staring at me anymore. And setting needles. Barbs with a length of wire used for it with a needle injector to wire the jaw shut. Okay, there's what we need. So let's somehow do this. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm gonna need a sip of tea before I tackle this. We're gonna set the face. Pull the manipulator up and press the injector button to drive barbs into the skull. Then twist the wires to shut the jaw. Oh. 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 Am I doing this right? Oh god. Yep, I am. Okay. Guys. Look away. Look away. <laughs> there we go. Okay, okay, we're, we're done with that. What's next? Where's the spooky stuff? I don't want to- I don't want to do more of the mortuary tasks. <laughs> okay, uh, let's pull out our clipboard. What do we got? Insert eye caps. Okay, perfect. Uh, placing eye caps. Use the manipulator to open the eyelid completely. Interact with the eye to place the clap, then close the eyes. Okay. Oh. No? Do, oh wait, probably need to put them in first? I can't use that here. I just did though, I saw it go in. You're a liar? You're actually a liar, it went in? What? I can't use that here. <gasps> well, oh that seemed weird. Never ever, ever open a dead person's mouth. <laughs> Uh, okay, what do I need to put? Actually, let's look at our clipboard. Don't- I, I need to not guess what we're doing next. Mix embalming fluid and pump. So we need... Luteraldehyde? I don't know if I'm saying that even right. I said- close enough. It's close enough. Okay. So which one was that? Am I holding it already? Or can that's I just- That's not it. Okay. Oh! that would do it. Okay. I think it's these. There's formaldehyde. Cool, cool, cool. Hold anything else. Oh. Oh! I click on it in here. Drop. I figured it out. Where did I just drop it on the floor? That seems like a hazard, actually. Okay. Woo! Ah! Hmm. Sometimes we get chemicals that haven't been stored properly, and it can make them pop like that. Just keep doing your thing. I'll get it. I think you're lying to me. I don't think that happens. This this guy is, is lying to me, actually. Formaldehyde, put that in there. Thanks. Okay, here's the, whoops. The glutalorohide, yeah, something like that. I don't even care. I'm saying it how I want to say it. Put it in there. Thank you. I said it right, cool. <laughs> OSHA is displeased. <laughs> After all those OSHA training videos I've seen over the years. Uh, let's see. Click this and that. Okay. Chemicals. And we got methanol as well. Just, okay, let's get all of the... Okay. I did it. Can you stop staring at me? You said you were gonna get this. He's a liar. He didn't get it. Actually a liar? Okay. This guy must be Conrad's cousin. <laughs> okay. Make an incision. And the uh, artery and jugular vein with the scalpel. Well, this is... I don't think I want to do that. I don't... Oh, God. Some items need to be used directly on the body to use an item. Open the quick inventory and select the item. Yeah, I already figured that out. Okay, okay. Well. Let's see. What was it? Oops. I'm. Am I? Oh! You can't look at. Okay, scalpel. So then use forceps to clamp tubing to both veins and connect the embalming pump. Okay. Okay. So. 
forceps. Whoop. Yep. 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 And this. I'm missing something. Oh, I'm missing something. Okay. What am I missing? Back. Oh, do I not have the other thing they were saying? Must be one of these. Let's see. Was this one? No. And this one. Yes. Take it. Get it. <gasps> okay. Oh. Yep. That's. That's about right. I can't use that. Hand. No. Okay. Back. Back. Go back. Thank you. Okay. Engage the pump. I think I can do that. I think I know how to engage a pump. I did it! Aren't you proud of me? He's not proud. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna look at that. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna look over here. That was a, that was a lot of blood. <laughs> You're fine with this, just not the teeth thing? Oh, see, I'm the reverse where I'm not, I don't wanna see the blood. We'll just look up right here. This is fine, this is fine. Staring judgingly. <gasps> okay. Why are you still watching me? Oh my god, I hate him. Look, he just follows me wherever I go. He's creepier than the dead body, actually. Hi. How you doing? He's very... Very judging, actually. Well... Still not nighttime yet. We're doing great. Turn off the pump. Oh, wait, no. Okay, yeah. We let the body drain, so it was just waiting for me to turn it off. Well, that's annoying because the turn it off is on the different. I was waiting for it to finish. This is annoying. Okay, let's take all of that out. Close this up. Okay, we good. We all good. Okay, fill an empty IV reservoir bag with cavity fluid, then insert. Okay. This? Come here. Yeah. No, pick it up. Take it. Thank you. And then we use that here. That's not it. That's that's not it. Oh, it's already full, because I filled it up accidentally earlier. Just kidding. I'm already like three steps ahead. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, then insert. Ah. We're inserting things into a cavity. Okay, the abdomen. Oh, here we go. Uh, insert the trocar until it stops to begin the flow of embalming fluid. Once that cavity is full, pull the trocar back, rotate it, then reinsert in until the reservoir bag is empty. Okay. Ah. Oh. Oh. Guys, I don't like the noise. <laughs> uh, keep rotating it. There we go. Got it. <laughs> no thanks. Hate it. <laughs> We're all actually just here to, to hate about how gross this is. Come on. Rotate. There we go. I mean, points for ASMR, yeah. right? <laughs> Hi, Dee Dee. Welcome on in. How are you doing today? And hello, Tom and Denmark as well. How are you doing? The noise is something. 100% the noise. Do not profane Mr. Wiggles like this. Uh, okay, cleaner base. Cool, large item. Uh, I'm going to assume we put it in there. Awesome. Can't hold anything else. Okay. What I, actually, I should check what I'm doing. Clipboard. Mix cleaners in the bathroom to... Okay, yeah. So I am doing the right thing. I'm so proud of myself. Oh, take that. Okay, gotcha. I figured it out. I'm smart. Let's see. You're back. Did you miss anything? Uh, we embalmed her. So that's fun. Okay, where are we taking this? And pour it into the embalming pump. Gotcha. Ah, I keep hitting. <laughs> oh my god. 
Oh my god, thank you, whoever played that. Thank you for the 250 bits. <laughs> Anonymous, thank you, thank you, thank you. That was, I'm, I, I can't breathe now. Okay, we're cleaning the tank. <laughs> and hello, Walker. Hello, hello, hello. <sighs> oh my god. Eh. What's next? Mix the cleaners to... Nope, okay, it's still working on it. Apply, apply moisturizer. I can't talk. The jump scare... scared the ability out of me. So, can I use this yet? All right, moisturizing. Move the wipe across facial features while holding down the interact until the location is used up. All righty. Ah. Daily skincare routine is very important. Oh my God, what the hell? Tell you what. What? Why don't you go ahead and head out? What? I'll take over from here. Wait, what do you mean? I just did all of the work. Are you sure? I just got here. What? Don't worry. You're doing great. I'll get the last of your I just got here. Today. Oh, and also, welcome on in, Terminator. What? I just got here. It's fine. I'll give you a call when we get someone in. But, okay. I drove all the way here for like 10 minutes of work? All right. This, this feels weird to me also. Oh. I'll go. Wait, I just walked through the door? <laughs> That did not open before I was through it. Oh my god. Really weird. <laughs> Saying you love jump scares. No, I know. It wasn't even my fault, but he sent me home right after that. I'm just really worried. He's supposed to finalize my stuff today. You were drinking and not looking at the screen that just popped up and was loud. <laughs> oh. That's a good thing. Yeah. It just didn't feel the sound like ASMR. <laughs> You just said it to get me out of the building. True. Uh, wait a sec, I have another call. Hello? Hey, Rebecca. It's Raymond. Oh, hi, Mr. Delver. Uh, look, if I did anything wrong today, just... No, no. Uh, I wanted to apologize. You've done a fantastic job. I'm just not feeling too well. This guy's shady. So why I'm calling. So shady. Well, uh, yeah. Uh, are you sure? I mean, of course. <laughs> Excellent. Wait. You are doing me a huge favor. Wait. I took care of the rest of your onboard. Paycheck is a paycheck. <laughs> and your new badges and your personal belongings drawer in the back room. That's great. Uh, thank you. I I'm on my way right now. I hope you feel better. Thanks again. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Uh. Uh. Holy shit. That was him. He signed me on. He needs me to come in tonight. See? I told you it was fine. Congratulations. Thanks. I have to go. Like, right now. I'll talk to you later. Uh, where are my keys? Is that a microwave on the wall? Yes. Yes, it is. Also, we have... What is this? I bring it closer to my face? Is it coffee? I want the coffee. It looks like a coffee bag, but I can't see what it actually is. Stuff. It's just stuff! <laughs> you guys want some fresh stuff? What does that say? I can't tell what the, the top part says. Donut stuff. Oh, I got it. I got it. It's donut stuff. Yeah! I want some donut stuff coffee? Heck yes. I got it. The nicest people are dead? Oh, that's dark. Oh my god. <laughs> Music band shirt. Sports. Oh my god. Oh my god, I love this. So much sass. That's all we have the budget for is the one song radio. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let's go back to work, I guess. Unless you guys want some tooth time toothpaste. Or some Luna bits. Oh my god. Can I open the fridge? Oh, nope. I'm throwing potato chips. Okay. I'm too fascinated with all of this. 
Looks like it's after its expiration date. Well, then we should probably throw it away. That's gross. Uh, can I go? No. Okay. Are my keys? Uh oh. Really? How do you always lose your keys in this apartment? I need to know. How do you always lose them? Oh, look, keys. Ah, temporary items do not take up space in my inventory. Use a temporary item by directly interacting with the object. Okay. Cool. Well, let's go. Some light reading. <laughs> Oh, you're feeling a bit run down from yesterday? That's fair. Sound like you did a lot of heavy lifting. All right. The tables look good, though. Get started. <sighs> it's just thunder. You okay? Did something else happen? I just heard thunder. Why are you gasping at thunder? What's this? Well. Oh. Mr. Delver, I need help. Someone's outside the mortuary. Just what? Try to stay calm. Oh. What? This is very sudden, but listen to me. We have to start right away. I'm sorry. I didn't know until it made itself known this morning that it was here, let alone bound to you. I had no way of knowing the possession had started. What? Look, this isn't funny. Stop. You need to take this seriously. You need to act quickly. This is insane. I'll just leave. I'll just fucking leave. You can't leave, Rebecca. I, I can't allow that for you. Or for others. It's far too dangerous. <laughs> what am I supposed to do then? Most bodies I work with at night are fine. So we stay calm. Okay? We what do you mean? Calm, stay calm. Um, it's happening. Everything. Treat it like a normal day. Staying focused will help. I left some things for you on the desk. Okay. I'll call again when you get to the embalming room. That seems no, weird. <sighs> What the I'll call again when you move to the next room. Insane. Okay. Uh, guys, what's happening? Okay. What is happening? This is so stupid. It's just some hazing for the new girl or something. Just, just play along and do Scott. your job. Let me out! Let me out! I welcome in! Uh, Ikikia? Hello, hello, hello! How are you doing? Uh... Guys, oh, tape recorder, okay. Old key and hall key. Awesome, thanks, I guess. Anything else? Any more presents for me? No? Uh, I actually have to use a key now? Come on. All right, that seems excessive. I'm fucking quitting tomorrow. I mean, who does something like this? That's very fair. Um, We're probably not gonna survive this. Is he watching me on a camera? I'm not okay with this. How do you know I was back here? I'm- I'm- <laughs> call the cops. Just call the cops. I'm- look, I'm sorry, but this entire thing is extremely unprofessional. If this is how you treat new hires, I don't think I can work for you. This isn't funny. Rebecca, you don't have to believe me, but I hope you do before it's too late. The only way to save yourself is to banish the demon before you're too far gone. To do that, you will need to learn the demon's name, bind it to its chosen body, and burn it in the Look, I know this is a lot to take in. I wish I could do more for you. I had years to learn what I know. You have hours. <sighs> I've recorded a number of cassettes to instruct you in the hope that having a physical object with a known message will help you stay grounded. I will be oh. again. Okay. You can't trust the phone. Can't trust the phone. Well, that's ominous. This is insane. Whatever. Just be the professional one, grab a body, and get started. <gasps> okay. That sounds very rough. Mini cassette tape. Ooh, take it. At every moment, the demon is funneling its energy through you, weakening you, until you are unable to resist. Okay. Identifying a demonic I'll totally is normal. a delicate balance. The further you are from possession, the more time you have. The closer you are, the more the demon will make itself known, allowing you the information to guess its name and the body it's bound to. The only way I've found to tell how far along a position
possession is on your own is to scribble on a piece of paper. Okay. Don't scribble think on a piece. About it. Just scribble. Just scribble. Okay. Do I have some paper to scribble on? A small cassette labeled Night Shift System. Let's see what this has to say. The Night Shift database. A computer program combining all my findings into one reference point. The okay. database contains all the information on the process of expulsion, the tools used, and most importantly, all the markings of the known demonic names. If you ever forget what to do, replay these tapes or look it up in the database. Okay. Thanks, Raymond. Is the most crucial piece to the puzzle. You will need this information. Yes, because we need to know which one to burn. Gotcha. My personal belongings drawer. On the back is the passcode to access it. Use it. Okay, well, here's the question. What if I just burn all the bodies now? I feel like that's my best course of action. Whatever. Just grab a body and get started. Don't tell me what to do. Just burn all the bodies now. Just do it. Just do it. Let's see. Also, welcome on in, Esther. You know the game because Markiplier played the demo. <laughs> Did I ever watch Markiplier's playthrough of it? I don't remember. I feel like I watched a Gab Smolders play it. I don't know if I watched Markiplier. Who do we have? We've got Logan Morgan. <laughs> That's a name, Logan Morgan. Theodore Matthews and Janine Andrade? Andrade? I don't know. Can I go this way? No. Okay. So those are our names. Cool. I did not open the cabinet yet because I'm checking things out. I wanted to see who we had. Because obviously, if this was a real life situation, I would just burn the bodies immediately. That's... <laughs> uh... Oh good, a stapler. Y'all want a stapler? We got plenty of them. Okay. The Book of Typhoon Con Conversions? Oh god. I don't want to read all this. This is a lot of reading. Typhon walked among his disciples and he spoke, He who does not truly let the Lord into his heart shall be judged by his sin, and destined to serve those who truly believe, for all are assigned to the halls of hell. Cool. Abandon God as he has abandoned you. <laughs> Bring Lucifer into your hearts and revel in his glorious sin, for all are damned. This is very positive. Very positive. God. Well, this is wonderful. That's a, that's a good thing. This is, let's see, do we have a key for this? Yes, we do. Old key. Yeah, screw all of whatever this is. I'm getting back to work. <laughs> no, I think this is important, actually. To banish a demon to hell, it must be bound to its chosen body and burned. The three objects in this cabinet are your tools. First, the clay tablet in the center is called a mark. Placing the smaller pieces in the spell the demon's name. Second, the bottles on the top shelf are a special <laughs> You don't want your game to give you a side reading. <laughs> Add a bottle to the embalming mixture during the process. When the mark is placed on the correct body with the reagent inside, it will force the demon to become bound to Okay. It. Pay attention to signs that you have chosen correctly. They can be obvious or extremely subtle. Once you are certain the demon is bound to its vessel, burn it. burn it. Finally, the pieces of paper on the right are called letting strips. It must inscribe the sigils of its name in our world to begin the evocation. You will need to uncover these sigils to use them. Hold a letting strip. Oh, there's more. Okay. Torture. But wait, there's it more. To smolder and burn, you're close. When the paper combusts, the sigil has been revealed somewhere in that area. They could be anywhere. So look on walls, under objects, inside furniture, anywhere. The demon will inscribe its sigils over time to try and hide them. So check regularly. Okay, it's time to just destroy look, this place? Sigils, cool. Use the night shift database to decide which demon you're dealing with, and use that knowledge to create the mark. The steps are simple. Add the reagent to the embalming mixture. Uncover the sigils. Build the mark and place it on then, when you're certain, burn it in the retort. 
Oh. Fascinating. Okay. Go away. We don't have that information yet. We gotta rip this place apart. Let's see. We still have it. Wait, we. Oh, we don't have a clipboard anymore. Sad day. Wait, so I have to remember the embalming steps? Uh oh. Uh oh. Wait. Oh, right. I have to grab my gurney. For some reason, I thought this was just a table, but no, this is our gurney. Grab it. Come here. Let's go get a body. It sounds like totally normal mortuary stuff. <laughs> the boss locked us up. And he's seeing there's a demon. Exactly. Shit out of me. Let's start with Janine. Come here, Janine. Boop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doo. Use the gurney. Let's pivot. Pivot. I really wish this mechanic was a little better, but it's okay. I'm a professional. Oh yeah. Eh. And then stare at the eyes. Pivot. 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 Eh. Nailed it. Okay. Go. Go back in. Excuse me. Okay. Fine. Stay out. See if I care. Let's just take- Oh god. Okay. Okay. Crossed arms guy has been busy. <laughs> kind of a weird hobby though. Uh, it definitely is. There you go. All right, let's check you out. Okay. Oh, do I have to pick up the clipboard? Oh yes, there's our clipboard. Hello. I can keep track of things. Exactly. Okay, rotate the hand. Okay, no contusions or abrasions. I'm I'm a profesh professional now. What? Help? Can I have a flashlight? Hello? Please stop it. Oh god. What am I doing over here? Nope. New job. I'm getting out of here. Yep. Run. Run. How long I went to school? Nope. You clear path. Nope. Try to leave. Try to leave. No. Maybe everything's fine. It's it's fine. Oh God. What? No, I. I can't walk. Help! Someone has sent help. I'm just saying things. I need to get back to work. Yeah. So I think I'm being possessed. Just call it a hunch. You're glad she's sane and spoke too soon. <laughs> <laughs> the timing there. I don't- I don't think we're okay. Can I please take this? Give me the- give me the crucifix. I need it. Give me the cross, please. It's, okay. Well, guess we're going back to work. Oh, I'll love this character. Just nope, nope, new job <laughs> is the correct reaction. <laughs> okay, um, looks like we got some scratches there. Anything on the back? Don't think so. Okay. Back it on up. Look at your- Ooh, this. I'm getting back to work. So I ain't afraid of no ghosts. <laughs> Beautiful achievement right there. I actually think I am afraid of ghosts. I think I was possessed by a demon that had nothing to do with me being brave or not, to be completely honest. Uh, ooh, what's this? Why is it, was it like glowing? Y'all all right there, lady? Oh God. There we go. There we go. Okay, I finished. I did it. I nailed it. Let's go put this into the system. Alright, name. We got Janine. And she's 28. Cool. Let's see. Right shoulder. We have a mild abrasion. Left arm. We have... What does that even say? Hemangioma? Hmm, okay. And right leg. We have another contusion. I, excuse me, contusion, thank you. Uh, I believe that was all, yes. Three out of three, perfect. And submit. Yeah, I did it. Is it printing? We gotta go file it now. Just normal, normal night work at the mortuary, you know? Winner, winner, pizza dinner. Just, oh, pizza. Oh my God, I want pizza. And not the fake pizza I made with a tortilla earlier this work week. Let's see. Yeah, we already know that. Okay, let's go file this. 
Sprinty, sprinty, sprinty. You Time to go there. Time to embalm. All right, guys, I gotta remember the steps. So uh, was it, what was first? Oh yes, we gotta drain the fluids, right? Or do we set the teeth first? Yeah, no, you have to close holes first, otherwise liquids come out of them. So where was our, um, let's see. Setting needles, there we go. Uh, is this one? Right, needle injector, setting, yep, setting needle. Okay, perfect. Uh, might as well pick up the scalpel while you were here. Boop. Actually, yeah, we'll just pick up everything, because I think I have enough small slots to pick up everything. Yep, eye caps. Grab one of these. What else do we need? Because we'll get the liquids later. Let's see. Ah, yep. Here we go. Everyone who doesn't like this part, look away. We are setting the jaw. <laughs> Ugh. Eh. Screwed that up. Please wire the jaw shut. Thank you. Come on, close it. All right, that's done. Now we are moving on to eye caps. If I can remember how to do it. Let's see. Oh no, you had to do this first. I can't use No. How did I do this? Don't I need to do eye caps? How did I put those in? Oh, there it goes. It was just I have to click directly on the eyes. See, this makes no sense when it keeps telling me I can't use it here, but then it works. Oh, if you just click on it, gotcha, gotcha. Haha, <laughs> I know what I'm doing. So now, time to embalm, yes. The thunder is amazing. Oh, we actually have the little recorder over there. Okay, cool. Alrighty. Uh, let's see. Actually, okay, yeah, let's go ahead and look at the clipboard. No, because mix the embalming fluid in the pump first. Wait, what does that say? Regent in the old cabinet. Oh, <gasps> oh, the reagent. Where? Let's go find the reagent. Eh, put that away. In the old cabinet. Reagent right here. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Use time to identify a demonic tenancy. That's terrifying. That's terrifying. But let's go put that in here. All right, whoops, no. Open it first. Thank you. And put that in there. Perfect. And this one should be, let's see, what is this? Yeah. Put that in there. Believe this was one of the ones we needed. What is this? Oh no, bleach. No, we don't need bleach, actually. No bleaching agent. Formaldehyde is one we need. There we go. Just put Can't some. Use that here. Wait, why not? Oh, I just wasn't lined up properly. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, targeting system. Okay, you. I need methanol. Can I pick it up? Thank you. Hippa dippa do. Get you in there. Perfect. Okay. Uh, let's see what. What liquid are we still missing? We still need the glutaldehyde or whatever. What is that? You guys want some ultra swan? <laughs> some dish soap, apparently? Is that this one? Hi. I can't even pick that up. Oh, oh, there it goes. Wait, tissue builder. Used for restoring a mo more full look to thin or weak skin. Well, that's not what we need. Where is... Just open. They make the funniest sound. Hit. <laughs> okay, oh, here. There you are. Boop -a -doop -a -doo. Any demon tendency here? Porsche's juice. Oh god. What? Oh. Hello? Who the fuck are you? You're not Janine, guys. Uh, Ultra Swan, just like Mother used to make. Uh, uh, 
You are not the right bot. Who the heck are you? Where's Janine? Janine? Are you? Are you? Guys, I'm pretty sure this was Janine. Okay, you're still there. You're still here. Okay, so whose body do we have out there? Guys, I'm scared. Where's Janine? Okay, well, this is going well. I already lost a body. <laughs> Let's put that in the not good column. <laughs> um, okay, well. Hmm, my clipboard doesn't tell me how to deal with the changing body, but I guess, let's see, can I use, what, what can I do with this? Excuse me? Oh, oh, oh. I found Janine! <laughs> we have lost a body, but I also gained one. Exactly, that gain was zero. We're fine. Um, okay, well, this is going well. Ah, scalpel. Ah. Okay, we're doing the embalming process. If anyone is squeamish here, look away. This is the part I don't like, to be fair, but uh, let's see. Forceps. I'm missing something. Oh yeah, I need the, the tubing. Right, whoops, uh, back. Uh, where do we think the tubing is? I don't remember seeing that. It was all nicely laid out for us earlier. Ah, uh, tubing. Yes, okay, there it is. Found it, nailed it. Let's get that in there. Uh, okay, back. Nope. Oh god, the sound. Access card, there we go. We need, didn't we need this? Oh, can I not pick it up? Oh, I can't, oh, okay. Extra keys, okay. Raymond, I really need a key to the hatch outside. Cleaner is low and you mentioned having some down there before. No, you don't trust anyone? Okay, la 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 la, Zoe. Alright, cool. This is done. It changes sounds when it's finished. I figured that out. Uh, now we need to clean it, is that right? Remove tubes and close the incision. Gotcha. Yay. Everything else normal? I think so. Uh, let's see. Take that out. Close. I love how there's, like, no sign that the incision was ever there. I feel like that's not how flesh works, but that's cool. All right, embalming time. Yes. Let's see. Clipboard. Cavity fluid. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. So, where were our bags? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right here. I left it open so I would see it. Yep, take... Take that, thank you. And fill that, thank you. Okay, this, uh, everyone plug your ears. <gasps> oh, uh, uh. Nice while they got there, you're not looking at the blood. <laughs> exactly, this one, yeah, I don't like that part. That is, that's the worst part for me. This one is second worst, the noise alone. Ah. Uh. Don't like when the point of view camera is that close to the cadaver's face. Keep thinking they're going to turn and bite. I mean, they just might with how this game is going. Ah, uh, 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 and rotate. Ah, uh, okay. Whew. Okay, next up we have mix the cleaners. Yep, 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 okay. Everything's fine. Oh good, I can open these. That's probably bad. Wait, just jump out, escape, go. You're free! Just leave! Oh, just leave. I can't talk right now. What? Hello? Don't trust the phones. Rebecca? Rebecca? What the? What? Is that- that sounds like me? Uh, I'm concerned. Okay, cleaner base, take that. Eh. 
Okay. All right, there we go. Run back, this is fine. Tile's really dirty. <gasps> uh, don't worry though, the tank is gonna be clean. Boom. Tank is clean. Uh, let's see, apply moisturizer, right? Uh, where's our moisturizing wipes? Okay, uh, where... Do we, do we see the moisturizing wipes anywhere? I don't remember seeing them. Maybe they're over here? There was that. Oh, what's this? My new work badge. Oh. Oh, hey. Hey, wait. I can rotate these. Oh, cool. Eh, get out of here. I need the wipes. What is, why is there this weird glow in these cupboards? Okay, I can't open the bottom one. Gotcha. Countertop. Uh, did I just absolutely miss them? Oh, yeah, right there. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> Let's gotta make sure she looks nice and pretty. There you go. Aw, yeah. Skincare routine, flying solo, achievement unlocked. Nice. I got a promotion, heck yeah. It's a freaky game you wish you could play, but the actual embalming part makes you too squeamish. Still enjoyable to watch others play, though. I was like, yeah, I was struck. There's, there's certain aspects of the embalming part that is like, oh god, I don't want to watch that, but overall, I'm handling it okay. Let's close, close all these. I look like an absolute noob, leaving everything literally open. Close that. Okay, what's next? Return body. Ah, that makes sense. Let's go. Come on, Janine. Let's go for a ride. Okay. Oops. Let's see. You went in this one, correct? So actually, nothing happened with the... Uh... The reagent? Nothing happened with that, so does that mean this one's not going to be a demon? Eh. Use gurney. Pivot. 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 Come on. Eh. Get on in there. Oops. Eh. Give me, please. Excuse me. Pull. Yep. Get. Get. Give me the gurney back. It's being very touchy. There we go. Okay. And put Janine away. Bye, Janine. You be safe in there. All right. Uh, next body, I guess. <laughs> Walking backwards in horror game, always safe. Well, now I'm gonna be scared to walk backwards. Oh man. Okay, who do we want to do next? Theodore or Logan? What do you guys think? <laughs> I'm leaning towards Theodore. Yeah, let's do Theodore. Hey, Theodore. Wait. Are you the same dude that was out there earlier? Theo! Okay, get that body. Oh, you're not looking so hot, to be honest. Okay, pivot. Eh. Eh. Okay. And go. Theodore sounds like a good guy. <laughs> Continuing horror game story. Always perfectly safe. Absolutely. There we go. What? Hello? I heard a voice. Excuse me. Would you like this vase? It's rubber. <gasps> Guys, that was an achievement to throw the vase! I did it! And the achievement said yeet on it. Oh my god. I win. See, and this is why I don't like it when people tell me what the achievements are. That's so much fun. Oh, I can actually leave. Why is my car door open? Run! You're free! Wait, can I, can I just leave? Or do I just sit here? <laughs> I apparently just sit in the car. Wait, what? Okay. Uh, 
I, I thought I couldn't leave at all. Dude, what's out here? Oh good, there's a back door. And it's not locked. That means someone can come in through here? Uh, this is probably bad. I'm gonna go back in. Close, close that. Can I lock it? I think we should lock it. All right. Uh, well, I heard a voice, but as far as I can tell, no one is around. Hello? No? Okay. Cool. Actually, will she let me look at this now? No, I don't want this. Uh, exit? Let's look at this. System is only for Riverfields morticians with access rights. Please enter my night shift code. All right, so I need a night shift code. Oh, I wonder if that's on his badge. Barm. Let's see. Uh, Mr. Delver's work badge for body pickup at local hospitals, full access. Who's, wait. 1944? What year is this set? What? Well, there's our code. Okay, 5801. Cool, cool, cool. And back. 5801. Let's go type that in before I for... Get it? Nope, no distractions. No distractions, 5801. <laughs> Some really interesting paranormal evidence. <laughs> All right. Uh, what do we got? Database is a collection of all the findings related to the banishment of covetous demons, the history of the demonic, and the tools I have found through my research. Years of travel and piecing together whatever relics remain have been compiled here. The navigation bar at the top right leads to the following subsections. Okay, we got history of the demonic, identifying demonic tenancy. Oh, we probably want to check that one out. Sigils of demonic names and tools to combat demonic forces. All right, let's... Wow, that is very, very slow to load. Yeah, 1998, that makes sense, I guess. <laughs> you weren't even born. Oh. Uh, see, I, I was four years old then. Let's see. You're sad they didn't include dial-up tones? Oh! <gasps> yeah, where's the dial-up tones? Come on, I need that throwback. All right, let's see. While learning the name of the demonic entity is more about waiting, identifying which body is experiencing demonic tendency requires paying close attention. While any of the bodies can be manipulated, it is far easier for the entity to control its own vessel. Sudden movements, large or small, can be a sign of tendency. If a body appears to be more active than others or strange markings start to appear, it may be signs of demonic tendency. However, the demon is trying its best to remain elusive and may manifest these manipulations on other bodies, which is why it is important to take note of which body is experiencing these events. The more events linked to a specific body, the more likely it is to be the chosen vessel. The appearance of new markings on the body, sudden movements, large or small, repeat movements. Is one body more active than the others? Okay. When a demonic entity is present, the vessel it is occupying may form markings not previously observed. Inspecting a body additional times is important to spotting these. Okay, okay. A body with a demonic inhabitants may display sudden movements. These movements can be as small as a twitch of the fingers or as large as a full body manipulation. We got a video. Oh my god, video right. time. This working? Yeah. This thing is huge. So, uh, I guess, um, this is David. Raymond, this feels insane, but I think you were right. This has happened a few times now, but... Feet. Show me them feet. <gasps> ah! Never mind. Don't show me. Don't show me. Stop. <laughs> I regret it. Fuck! <laughs> okay. You had three kids by 1998. Feels old. Oh no. <laughs> uh, time to get our learn on. Hi, David. David's totally dead. Exactly. Such a boomer. Is this a thing? Is this thing on? <laughs> oh, okay. Let's see. So that's about identifying it. Sigils. Uh, we'll probably look at this when we actually find a sigil, because otherwise I'm not going to remember what else we got in here. 
tools. Okay, see, an entity must be bound to its original vessel and that vessel destroyed in order to stop the process of possession. Throughout your, my work, I have managed to discover and establish a set of tools to bring about banishment of demonic entities. The occupied body must contain the reagent. Uh, the mark must have the correct demonic name and the mark must be placed on the correct body and burned. Below are th all the tools you are aware of, I am aware of, and their usage. The mark. The mark is one of two tools used to bind the demon to its chosen vessel. Each slot holds a sigil that represents a part of the demon's name. When all four are placed in the correct configuration, place the completed mark on the vessel believed to have demonic tenancy. Okay. I, I think we're going to read all of this once we actually are a little bit further along. Because, like, let's try and figure out which demonic name. Let's see. Oh, we have history. Is that going to be useful for to us? in any way, shape, or form? Probably not. Unless, let's see, some of the words simply do not have a ba da ba da ba da Okay, maybe we'll need some of these words later, but yeah, let's, let's go and find some more information before reading all of the lore. We don't want to do a lore dump, please and thank you. Hey man, what's up? You're like, smiling and it makes me uncomfortable. Oh! Hello? Guys, there was someone at the door. He's really most sincerely dead. Absolutely. Okay. Well, I forgot what I was doing. Right, we have to we haven't observed or uh, examined the body yet. We gotta actually do that. Okay, nothing weird going on here. Let's, uh, we got an abrasion here. Nothing else there. S can I, oh, whoops, no. I, okay. Maybe we can get that from the other side. Did you just spoil Stranger Things for me? I think you just did. I haven't seen the fourth season. So... Cool. <laughs> nah, that's it. It was from the first season? Wait. Then I don't remember that. What, a fake one? I'm confused. Then I apparently don't remember season one. Huh. Nothing else? I, I, there's something on his belly. Is that just his belly button, actually? Oh, that's such a weird belly button. It looks like a just a little round cut. That's actually a belly button. Guys, I didn't even notice. Okay, that's not normal. <laughs> so you've seen some gameplay of this game. Is it true that it is randomly generated events? Something weird's happening. No? What? Hello? My own shadow just scared me. Actually, don't know. Is this actually scripted? This was like, yeah. I don't know if it's randomly generated, honestly. Um, did I get them all? Three out of four. No, I'm missing something. Did you? Something weird happened. Oh, I haven't looked at the other hand. Uh, this one. Rotate. There it yeah. is. Yeah. Uh, let's see. What do we do next? Right, take this and put it into the, you gotta print out the records. Bidoop, recording system. Let's see, name, we got Theodore Matthews, age is 36. Right shoulder, we got mild abrasion. Left shoulder, uh, have, Kirotalias, uh, words, I don't like them. Rash, I can say rash. And left leg, rash. No, left leg, sorry. Not right leg. Okay. I think that's everything. Submit. Yeah! And we'll print that out. Back. I keep thinking I see people standing down the hallway. So that's fun. That's fun. Nope. Nope, not today. Not today. Whoops, I pulled up the wrong thing. Please go away. Embalming report. There you go. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go back. Just gonna go back. Okay. 
What's next? Why are the jaw? All right, jaw people who don't like jaws. That sounded weird. <laughs> people who don't like jaws, look away. Take it. Setting needle. Let's get all the equipment. I really wish you could like pick up the items without having to pull up the menu explaining what they are. Uh, what the heck was that? Did I just see something in there? Uh, okay. Did I get everything? Yeah. Boop. Look away, jaw. People who don't like the jaw thing, look away. I'll let you know when it's over. Eh, this is terrifying. Eh, close it. Close it. Okay, jaw is done. We are moving on to eyeballs. Let's. So, why is it not letting me. Rebecca? Hello? Whoa. No, I want to put the eye caps in. I don't want to. I don't want to. So, oh, is that why it wasn't letting me do it? Because it's like it's about to do a, a cut scene. Or, well, not really a cut scene. Um. Well, this seems fine. Mm. Hello? You stupid bitch. Hate me all you want. He's dead because of you. You should be the one here. Lightless. Think that for all this is Oh god. Oh. I'm gonna leave me alone. I'm gonna go. No, no, no! Okay, well, um, thanks, but nope, 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 nope. This seems fine. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. Put in the eye caps. Uh, now they're good. Now it lets me do it. Please. I can't take this. What's gonna happen next? Okay, let's put this in. Okay, and we need this one. No, no, that's the bleaching agent. Don't do the bleaching agent. That's the bad one. We don't bleach the inside of the body. That's a no-no for mortuary assistance. Uh, this one. Thank you. And boo -doop. And last we have, wait, no, I already did that one. Uh, not last, we still need the reagent, but we also need this one. Yeah, whoops. Get the methanol, good, good, good. Get that in there. And then the reagent. Thanks, game, for giving you nightmares tonight. <laughs> uh, hey. Phasma was getting not scary for us anymore, so we got We have to, you know, step it up, right? Okay. That's done, so now we need to cut. Yep, incision. Good, good, good. Ah! Why do I keep thinking it's tab to put it away? Tab just feels more natural. Let's see. I have the scalpel, right? Do I have... So I need the scalpel. Uh, we still need tubing. Get this. Take that, thank you. Oh god, not again. What? Who's there? Why aren't you coming? <gasps> Cause I don't want to. Please let me close the door. Here. No, I don't want to. Leave me alone. No. Just hide. Wait till the hunt's Becca. over. Oh god, I have to go down there, don't I? Ah! <laughs> We're busy. I am embalming a body here. You're so oh rude. God. I don't want to. <laughs> oh, that's worse. That's much worse. Oh, what did you miss? Well, there's demons. Uh, yes. <laughs> Come over here. <gasps> no. Oh, oh, that's it. That's all you do. Wait, why is this locked now? Excuse me. Let me in. Okay. Well. I Woo! Uh, guys, I can't see. Oh, I don't like this. The glowy red eyes. <laughs> Sir, this is a Wendy's. <gasps> okay, I guess we go back to embalming the bodies. That's. I just walked through the door again. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, let's cut that open. Uh, put in you. And you, okay. Ah. 
engage the pup. Okay, so people that don't like the embalming process, look away. This is this includes me. I don't like this part. So actually, yeah, I won't really be looking. To be honest, I'll do this. I don't like looking at it either. So. You had, I had opened the cabinet with the clay items when you had left. Did you miss anything crazy? Yes. You have missed quite a few things then. <laughs> so let's see. There was a, a weird flashback where our mother turned into a demon. There have been weird happenings, bodies coming back to life. Okay, ready to turn it off. Okay. Okay, close the incision. Yes, yes, yes. Take that all out, close that up. Hey, wait, oh, that one actually le left a little cut. Apparently you just couldn't see it on the other model as well. Okay, embalming process is uh, sort of done. The pump part is done. Let's put it that way, because now we need to fill the reservoir bag. Yep, 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 okay. Now we're doing the gross ASMR part. Nah. I hate the gross ASMR part. Uh, let's see, and I should have- Oh, am I missing something? I am. I don't have the- I swear I picked one of those up. Whatever this thing's called. The trucker. Trocar? Trocar. I said it right. There we go. Okay. Look away if you don't like this part. <laughs> this is actually awful. Gonna have to watch the VOD? Probably, like, that was some spicy stuff. Okay, wait, come on, come on. Saw a weird vision of us and we wanted our body. <laughs> it was like raw. Had to get your ginger puffball cut. Just gotta s stick this trucker in your middle. <laughs> Might sting a bit. <gasps> Oh god. Come on, just make this fast. There we go. There we go! I did it! Was that it? Uh, right. Okay, bathroom stuff. Go. La 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 la. I feel like it'd make a lot more sense to have this connect uh, to the embalming room so I don't have to do all this running, but you know what? I guess whatever works. Okay, there we go. Was that picture cursed? Absolutely. That is some creepy thunder. Tank cleaner, there you go. Uh, now we need moisturizing wipes, that's right here. Take that. Gotta wipe their faces, gotta make them look pretty. Wait, can I not do it yet? Oh, I have, do I actually have to wait? Ugh, fine. La 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 la, this is all fine. Nothing weird going on here. Okay, now we should be able to do it. There we go. Uh, I don't even have to just. Okay. Hello, it's my own shadow talking to me. Okay, take it back to cold storage. Is there anything weird going on with his body? So far, I haven't seen any twitching or anything. Though he did talk to us, so maybe. I mean, that could just be the demon trying to confuse us, but let's keep in mind this body talked after we added the reagent. Also, he's kind of jiggling a little bit. Ew. Jiggle physics. <gasps> okay. Pivot. Because the first one talked to us, but we hadn't even put the reagent in. So that was probably just the demon messing with us. So this one's more sus to me. We can't trust Theodore here. Goodbye, Theodore. Get out of here. Oh, God. Okay. Next up, we have- wait, what's your name? Logan. Logan Morgan. That's right. Hello, Lo Logan Morgan. Your name's a bit of a tongue twister. Can I say that? Let's get this. There we go. And pull- come on. Pull you out. He's 30 years old. Fascinating. Let's look at his legs. Oh, we got uh, some cuts right there. Uh, rotate, please. Got some pimples right there. <laughs> uh, he's got a lot going on, to be honest. Rotate. Nothing on his back, though. Okay. Let's 
go to the head. I hate looking at the head. Ugh. Rotate this way. Nice ear. Rotate the other way. Ah, two nice ears. Fascinating. Mark that down in the journal. Rotate. Anything on this hand? Nope, that one's good. Stop rotating. Just go back. Thank you. Uh, we got a mole, it looks like. Okay, was that everything? Five out of six. Oh no, I missed something. What do we miss? Palm pimples are the worst. <laughs> he looks good for 30. What is that supposed to mean? <laughs> Left shoulder. I don't see anything. Let's see, rotate. Definitely nothing back there. Left shoulder slash chest. Didn't I already get that though? Yeah. Oh, I swear I clicked on that. Okay, no, I didn't. Thanks guys, thank you, thank you. Okay, now we're good. Let's go enter that in. Boop And thank you, Soapy, for the follow. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome on in. Let's add this in. Uh, name, Logan Morgan, age, 30. We've got a rash on the right shoulder. Left shoulder. Then blemishes on the right arm. Left arm is good. Mild abrasion on the right leg. And a mole on the left leg. He had a lot going on. Wait, what? which one did I miss? Blemishes, rash. What did I just... Left arm. This Head. That one. Get in there. Thank you. He looks good for his age. 30 isn't that old. You realize I, I, I'm i 27? <laughs> like, th th 30 is not old. <laughs> All right, time to embalm. Oh no, sorry, I have to go take this. Gotta make sure to uh, f do the paperwork correctly. And thank you for the alert, comrade. Have fun. Uh, where am I going? There we go. Okay, our vase is still there. Everything seems fine out here. Let's get this show on the road. Let's collect this. This. You. Just grab. Oh, God! No! Oh, that's creepy. That's so creepy. Okay, keep going. Just keep going. Oh, this sounds bad. Well, that's suspicious. I told you guys we can't trust Theodore. We're gonna inspect his body in a little bit, but I wanna get the reagent into all of them before things go to crap. <laughs> Theo. You missed it, what did I see? Oh, there was a demon like peering around this cabinet. So that was not okay. What, okay, what, what step was I on? Did I already pick up eye caps? I don't think I did. Let's grab that. Uh, yeah. That should be good. I'm scared. I'm scared. Okay. Jaw thing is happening. Look away if you don't like the jaw thing. Eh. Eh. Go. Do it. Faster. Stronger. Faster. Eh. Close it on up. Okay. Jaw is done. Moving on to cutting, right? That's the next part. No, eye caps. Eye caps, right. Okay? Let's get them eye caps in there. They, those ones need to be opened. And boop, and boop. Okay. All right. There we go. And now it's time to make the incision, right? No. I'm just so excited to make the incision. I think there's something wrong with me, but I actually have to make the embalming fluid first. So we'll get this in. Cool. Not the bleach. I'm learning, guys. You don't put, put bleach in the bodies. Look at me. I'm professional now. Excuse me? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hey! Give me that body back! I wasn't done with him! Uh... Uh... 
Uh, what do I do? I don't want to. I don't want to go into the darkness, but I need that body back. So, oh, ghost orbs. No, I'm not going. Whoa, what? <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> oh, thank you. It's brave for the fifty bits and the I'm in danger. That was so funny. <laughs> thank you so much. <gasps> I thought it was part of the game. <laughs> Oh, we're going this way? Okay. Oh my god, this is actually really cool. What the crap? I don't- I don't necessarily like this, but it's cool. <laughs> he wanted the bleach? Apparently, he was offended that I wasn't putting bleach in him. Whoa, oh my god, this is so cool. <gasps> I miss you so much. Okay, there's just a floating coffin? Oh my- Please, just- Oh. Dark? Okay. Okay. Somebody! Get me out of here! They're gonna... They're gonna kill me! Oh god. Stop it. Stop it. Sorry dude, I can't open the door. You're on your own! Bye! Sorry! High risk? Okay. Uh, maybe not- Don't take the high risk door. Is there a low risk door somewhere? <laughs> Perfect sound timing, exactly. I loved it. That was amazing. Okay. Keys? Oh! Okay. Okay, we got keys. Anything else? Can't go that way. Go back. Casket. Just a floating casket? What's this? Antidepressant. Oh. Medication used to treat depressive disorder and some anxiety disorders. Rebecca Owens, 300 milligrams, take once a day with food. So we have antidepressants. That makes sense, I guess. Uh, do I have to go back hello to the- uh, Hello there. <laughs> Thank you for the redemption there, uh, beads. That's what I'll say. Can I go through the- I changed my mind. Bye! I have a feeling I have to go through there, but... Alright. Well, okay. Into the darkness we go. Uh, hi. Yeah, I see you. I see... Oh. I feel like... I feel like there should have been a content warning for this. Uh, you know, at the start of the, the game. But there wasn't. Fuck this shit, I'm out. <laughs> Fuck this shit, I'm out. No thanks. <laughs> oh my god. Thank you, Anonymous, for the 300 bits. And that was perfect timing. Absolutely perfect. That was like, yeah. Something like that in a game. You should have a content warning. Like, that was... Hopefully, no one got caught off guard. Mm. I, okay. There isn't a day I don't think about you. Memories will flash into my mind uninvited in a moment of bliss torn down by unimaginable b guilt. Nothing they give me helps. I still have your necklace. It's one of the few things they let me keep in here. I'm not sure I can handle having it anymore, though I'm giving it to Grandma when she visits next. I want so badly to have that piece of you with me, but I'm afraid of it. I don't deserve it. You told me that when I was little, I would put it around my neck, around your neck, every morning as a way to wake you up. I guess kids just like shiny things and annoying their parents. I don't really remember it much, I just remember you being annoyed with me after the hundredth time. But I would give anything to put it around your neck one last time, to see you wake up. Oh god, this is getting dark. Oh god. Oh, I've thought about how I'm going to write this over and over, paper after paper thrown away. Then I realized it doesn't matter. Who's going to read this? Some nurse who will shake their head and move on? Some day, someone will think of me for the last time and I'll be gone like I should. Moment after moment, I've wasted. I lost you because I was selfish. Uh, this is getting into a very dark place. I'm sorry, okay, nope, I'm not reading the rest of that. Nope, that's a suicide note, enjoy. I'm not reading the rest of that. Mm -mm. See, so scanning it quickly, quickly, cause uh, it's, it's depressing. It's very depressing. That's what I was like, yeah, that absolutely needed a warning. So, uh, I apologize if anyone was caught off guard and couldn't handle that. That's why I'm stopping reading that. We just need to know it's a suicide note. Let's move on. Is that a coin in her hand? Oh, I did not 
see anything in her hand, so let me go check. Because maybe that's what I was missing. Because that'd be weird if that's all that was back here. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. There's something here. Ten-year coin, your sobriety coin. Okay. I can't do anything with it, though. So yeah, there was technically a coin, but... <laughs> okay, can't open any of these. Can't go that way. I will never get tired of saying that. Oh, no, we don't want to see that. No, get out of here. Oh my god, there's a box! There's a literal box sitting next to the suicide note. I'm dumb. I, fi I figured it out. I figured it out. There's gotta be something in here. Okay, dad's necklace. Oh no, it's just a sobriety coin too. Oh. There's nothing of use in here? Seriously? Oh. Never mind, I didn't figure it out. I'm still lost. <laughs> oh, do I need to... Oh. I don't think I like where this is going. Maybe a viewer discretion is advised at this next part. Oh no, it's fine. It's normal supernatural stuff. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. The spooky stuff is fine. Oh god, maybe. Oh. Cheers. Draw? Oh, could I draw, though? I didn't have a pencil with me. Well, I made it back. So, that's cool. Okay, but yeah, this, uh, this was a good sign that there might be other content like that in the rest of the game. So, if you are sensitive to topics around suicide, please probably don't watch. I don't know if any other stuff like that is going to show up. So, like, oh my god. That got heavy. Where were we on our process? We're going back to nice, pleasant embalming. I still need methanol. Okay. So we still need you. Whoops. Okay. Cha. Methanol and was it this one we still need? I think so. Yeah. Boop a doop a doop a doo. Oh god. Okay. Make an incision. Let's go. Maybe. Wait. I can't do it. Hello? I'm holding a scalpel, right? Yeah, scalpel. Wait, hold up. Oh no, sorry, reagent. Oh my god. Don't forget that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Reagent. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're right. I completely forgot I hadn't added that yet. Didn't see it off to the side again. Get in there. Oh, thank God it didn't let me go forward without doing that. That would have sucked. Okay, let's do this. Okay, here comes the cutting and weird crap if anyone wants to look away. I got that, and we still need the piping. So let's grab that. Come here. No, that's not what I want to do. This, please pick it up, please. Thank you. Okay, get the tubing. Put that in, cool. All right, time to embalm. Yep. All right, embalming part. Here we go. Nope. I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it. Where's it? Hey, why is that door closed? Let's go check that out instead. Eh. Oh, there's nothing I'm going down here. I think uh, the embalming process is done. And thank you, Mr. Thrash, for the follow. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This was like, yeah, this, I didn't know there was a sound a lot to bot. I actually didn't enable that, I don't think. Uh, no, you're not my grandma. I don't trust you. Uh, thanks, though. Thanks, though. Run, bitch! Run! <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> I wish I could. Oh my god, no. You're not my grandma. You are absolutely not my grandma. Okay, now we need to clean it. Yes, right? That's the next step. Drink! Drink! What is that? Oh god, I can't read it. I can't- I can't see it anymore. Ah! No, Grandma. I don't want to let you in. I'm in danger. I am in danger. <laughs> ah! No! Oh god, I can't run. I can't run. Let's see what's happening. And thank you just for a little bit for the 50 bits. The rubbish run. Oh god, she's got a knife. Maybe you could slit your wrist for me. Hydration, thank you. Just Mr. Thrash. Oh, thank you for the hydration. <laughs> so thank you, it's brave. <laughs> Way to ruin the dramatic suspense. <laughs> oh 
my god. <laughs> I just got brutally murdered by my grandma. We're just gonna pretend that didn't happen. Yeah? Okay, cool. We're gonna just move on. My poor grandma. Yep. Poor, poor granny. Okay, close the incision. That's right. Ugh. Sure, sure. It's not that scary. Definitely not at all. <laughs> You think yakety sacks is just what you, we needed? Yep, exactly. <laughs> okay, now it's cleaning time, right? What What is happening now? Okay. Um, no, we have to actually... What was I doing? I'm getting so distracted by what... Oh god, I can't read it now. Okay, IV bag, cavity fluid, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do this. Just ignore, ignore what's happening, just keep going. Fill that up. Uh, do I have... I think I have one of those already, right? Yeah. Okay, this part, look away. Plug your ears. Your grandma wouldn't stab your head. <laughs> Casual Saturday night, if you ask me. <laughs> This is a little bit out of the ordinary for my Saturdays, I can tell you that much. Eh, come on. Rotate. There you go. Ugh, I still hate that noise. I still hate it. Come on. Rotate. Oh, God. Stop. Rotate. Rotate. Please rotate. Thank you. <laughs> <sighs> Oh, I hate it. I hate it. No, don't stop there. No. There we go. <gasps> Thank you. All right. Oh, mix the cleaners. Okay, here's the cleaners. I knew it was coming. Nope. Nope. I'm ignoring it. I'm absolutely ignoring it. Just keep going. Just keep going with the process. <gasps> Where can we look for, like, the demon sign or sigil or whatever it was called? Because as far as I can tell, I can't actually look behind furniture like it said. But... Okay, that's cleaning. Ha! Ah, lol. Everything's fine. Let's uh, take this. I'm ignoring the noise. I'm completely ignoring it. You haven't lived until Graham Graham tries to kill you. <laughs> See? The noise stopped. It's all fine. Okay, we should be good to wipe his face now. Good, good, good. Ignore the thunder. Nothing weird is happening. All right. Okay, you're all done. Time to take you back into cold storage. Uh, any twitching going on? No. Okay, this one didn't talk to us after we put the reagent in. That's important to note. I'm pretty sure Theodore's the possessed one. <laughs> I... I'm pretty sure Theodore is the possessed one. You? Get back in there. You go. What are you doing out of your box? Go, 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 go. Bad Theo. Absolutely bad Theo. Hmm. <laughs> Burn Theo, yep. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Get in there. Thank you. Pull the gurney out. So I'm just gonna line this up with Theo's because I have a feeling we're gonna need that. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, should we reinspect Theo's body? Or should we try to look like I don't where can we look for the demon sigil? And uh, oh, hey, I still have Oh, I can turn on the sink. Does that mean I can flush the toilet? Good. Solid game. 10 out of 10. Immersion. That's the achievement I just got. <laughs> love it. Absolutely love it. Flush the demon out. <laughs> Open all the taps. Flush him out. Let's see, can I move? Nope, can't move. Oh! What the hell was that? I saw you. I saw you being sneaky over there. I hate it. I hate it. Let's see, can I... Oh, what's this? Oh! No? It's not the same code as before? Or was that 5081? Whoops. 
Oh, okay, no, it needed more input. Uh, let's see, have we found another code? I found a secret. Secret secrets? Let's see. Where could I possibly find another code? What is this? Oh, a letting strip, that's right. Oh, Special yeah. piece of scripture with the ability to reveal. <gasps> oh, right, right, right. Okay, when a demonic marking is near, the parchment will smolder and combust, bringing the marking into the material world to be found. Perfect, okay, then let's use this. Um, oh. Okay. Wait, what? Does that mean it's, oh, oh my God. So it's this, it is that. <laughs> oh my God, that's kind of cool. So if I'm over here, wait, is there like more than one demonic thing? Let's, cause yeah, so that, it's just, oh, oh, hey, hey, I found it. I found it. So we got this one. Man, that was cool. All right. Truman's, Demon's true name is composed of four sigils. Oh, so we have to combine them to get its, ap its actual name, I think is how that works. Got it. Okay, okay, I see, I see. Actually, it's very useful information. So we take this one. Do it. Let's try that. So we, we need another letting strip. Take this. Okay, and use it. Here we go. Ow! Well, that happened so quickly. Where is it? What? Hello? It's the biohazard symbol? Okay, cool. <gasps> oh, there you are. Okay. So now we got the weird swirly one. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Oh, do I have to like memorize all of them? Oh, okay. Cause you probably have to select them at once. Ugh, gross. Okay, but grab another letting strip. Unless, yeah, I can't do anything with that. Cool. Got that. Okay, and use. I said use. No. Okay. Oh, it's like a... <laughs> okay. So then we got that one. One more to go. Got it. No, I placed them. Okay. It doesn't seem- Oh, hey! Oh, it did! I swear to god, I tried that! Okay, thank you. Let's- Oh! Got it, it's click and then click. Gotcha, but then the problem is, is I don't know what order they're supposed to be in. Uh... Oh, god. They have ones that look so close, but I'm pretty sure it was this one. Whoops. Take that, good. Okay. Uh, nope, I need another letting strip. Thank you very much. Take that. And pull that out. Come on. Nothing? Can I go outside with it? Does it still work in the rain? <laughs> I feel like, no, close close that door. Is it actually go going to be outside though? Might be, be back by where the bodies are. Let's go back that way. Just, who's there? Come on. Here we go. Getting closer, warmer, warmer, hot, burning hot. Okay, it's the one that looks kind of like a G, got it. Okay, it's just a fancy game of hot or cold. <laughs> I like it. Let's see, one that looks like a G, this one, you go there. I just took it with me. Mark is one of the two tools used to bind the demon to his chosen vessel. Each slot hands a sigil that represents a part of the demon's name. When all four are placed in the correct configuration, place the completed mark on the vessel believed to have demonic tendency. The mark will react to the baleful reagent inside, binding the demon to it. Once the demon is bound, burn the body. Okay, the evocation can only be completed once the demon has inscribed the four sigils of its name into our world they're hidden from us until revealed yeah 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 yeah. once all four sigils are discovered the name of the demon will be known and the mark can be built we still have whatever's going on with this but i don't remember seeing anywhere there could be a code 
Should we look at Theo's body again? That's a great question. Let's see. Come here, Theo. We're gonna look at you again. I'm pretty sure you're possessed. Just call it a crazy hunch. Can I that was a weird turnaround that was so slow and creepy. I hate it. Okay. So far, everything looks fairly normal. How, how's your face doing? Okay, nothing weird going on. No? All right. Watch, they just want you to think it's gonna be Theo. Let's see, rotate. Still looks normal, which is weird to me. I feel like you're possessed. You're the demon? No. No, this is the demon, actually. That's the demon right there. Why does it feel like somebody's watching me? <laughs> Oh. Oh. Oh dear. Oh dear. And thank you, Pierre, for the follow. Welcome on in. I hope you're having an amazing day. I'm not at this point. <laughs> Why is it still dark in there? I hate this. Okay, okay, nothing with a code on it. Oh, welcome back to Yeet. Nice, fun chores, right? Everyone loves chores. <laughs> yes, yes, vase is still safe. That's the important part. I still think we should just leave. What the hell? Guys? I think I broke it. <laughs> what? I'm headless, actually? <laughs> I am the headless horsewoman. Uh, can I get out of the car now? <laughs> Epic. Uh, priorities, exactly. Game is a case on study on silent ghost events. Yes, we need those back in Phasmo. Okay, get out of the car, you freaky headless person. That was not okay. <laughs> it looks uncomfortable. I broke Rebecca. Let's see. Hello? Sorry. Okay, well, let's look at them then. It's not that one, not that one. Oh, it, oh it's this one. I, fa I did it already. It's it's Sebos, Sebos, Sebos. I did it. I nailed it. Okay, so it needs to be G on top, weird H on the left side, other weird H on the bottom, and swirly on the right. All right, easy peasy. Put that back. So let's see, G on top. Can I just swap them? Oh, well, that's not what I wanted to do. Can I put them back? Well, guys, I just, I screwed up even more. All right, so I just have to do a puzzle. Gotcha. Okay, so that one was on that side. You, let's swap you out with this, maybe. Okay. And Swirly needed to go on left side, so let's bop you out. So Swirly goes here, uh, G on top, and you there. Okay, that was right, right? What's the scariest jump scare I've gotten so far? Everything. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? Because like I said, the jumps, the, there aren't a lot of jump scares per se. Except like maybe like when the face popped up at us, but just when I turn around and there were things like peeping out of corners, those honestly scare me, me the most. Okay. Okay. Get that. You go bye-bye? Okay, let's look at- let's check out Janine again. We haven't seen her in a while. Come out. Come on out, Janine. How you doing? Though, were her feet always this color? Is that just the lighting? I'm actually- Are you making funny noises? Like, are her- Oh, stop! <gasps> that one, I think, scares me the most. Oh my god. I hate- <gasps> Guys, did I just die? I can't see anything. Did I just die? Did I just get straight up murdered by it? When does this stop? Dragged into the darkness? Yeah, this was like, I can't... I don't see anything. Am I even moving? Did I break it? Is this supposed to happen? Thank you, it's Bray for the 50 bits. Got him. 
This was like, yeah, did we just get a bug? Because I can't do anything. Uh, great. Exit, I guess. Resume. Close. And exit. I'm pissed. <laughs> Okay, okay, no, it- okay! Thank god, we just have to return the body to cold storage. So we're actually- we're not as far back as I thought we would be. So we don't have to re-embalm him. So far I'm not seeing a lot going on with their bodies. I'm pretty sure it's Theo. I just- I feel like it's Theo! <laughs> oh god! God, I feel like I prob- uh, but I need to take the body back. <gasps> no! Oh god, he's there! Uh, Theo, Theo, don't kill me! Please, Theo, have mercy on my soul. Theo, stop. Oh, I can't crouch and walk. Sad? Okay. I got you good. <laughs> oh, it's always been Theo. We just forgot about him. Oh, believe me, I didn't forget about him. It just- it seemed too obvious. Like, I felt like the game was intentionally trying to make me think it's Theo. I don't... <laughs> I'm no! in danger! Guys, I just got jump scared by that! <laughs> Thank you, Halibut, for the 50 bits! Oh my god! <laughs> I was so scared that the game was gonna crash again! <laughs> <gasps> oh my god. So like, to, to clarify what I was trying to say before I got distracted. Like, if I ask a question but I don't specifically direct it at chat, that is just me talking to myself. That does not mean I'm looking for help yet. If I want help from chat, I will make it easy and say, chat, let me know. Just so that we're all on the same page, no one gets confused. Because I, as a streamer, I just talk out loud. And sometimes it might sound like I'm asking a question when really I'm just thinking out loud. So, just to help clear it up for everyone, when I actually want help, I will ask chat specifically. Janine, you doing okay? Actually, let's, should we, I'm scared to bring Theo back out. I don't trust Theo. But let's, let's give Theo a look. <laughs> Come here, Theo. Theo! Theo, quit being stubborn. Theo! Why is this not working? Apparently my gurney's too close. Let's pull it that way. There we go. Theo doesn't want to come out, guys. Theo's shy now. Come here. Oh, it works better if you back up, FYI. I just discovered this. Dragging and pulling actually takes forever. Eh. Good streamer chat communication. Exactly. That's like, yeah. Because I know sometimes I do say things that might sound like a, que a question. And I apologize for that! What? The hell was that? Hello? Hello? I'm slowly being possessed. So that's fine. That's fine. Burn the Theo. <laughs> that's like, yeah, every time we interact, like, we've seen him walking around. I feel like it's gotta be Theo, right? Should we put the sign on him? The noise is starting again. I'm- I think it's Theo. Now we gotta burn it, right? Go, the noise is starting again. Oh god, oh god, I think I'm right, I think I'm right. Stop. Okay, how do we use this? How do I use it? Okay, maybe push the gurney. Gotta go feet first, feet first. Pivot, pivot, this is the pivotal moment, ha <laughs> ha! Sorry. Okay. How do I, how do I light it? There was no instruction on this. You get in there. Burn, Theo, burn! <laughs> it's anxious as heck. What? Nope, I don't want to. Oh wait, it just goes? I don't, I, wait. What did I need the mat? The matches are gone. Oh, I never picked up the matches again, did I? Oh God. <laughs> Sounds like Godzilla powering up his laser. <laughs> Oh god! Oh my god! Oh 
Oh, well, this, this seems bad. Help? No, get out of here. Get out of here, you stinky demon. Did I do it? Did I, did, did I live? Can we go see grandma now? <laughs> Just eep. <gasps> there you are. Good. Is it over? It's never over. Wait, it's never over? I survived. What do you mean? Can I leave? I want to go home. You can leave. But once an entity finds you, all the houses of hell will do anything to get back to you. I'm sorry, but it doesn't end here. Why not? From I... now on, there is always a chance this will happen again. No matter where you are. <laughs> Time to call Osha. I don't want this. I just want to leave. What do I do? I'm sorry, but there's no going back. I've spent years learning everything I can to keep these entities at bay. It's the only thing we can do. So what, you're waging some selfless holy war? It's not a war. It's survival. And I'd hardly call it selfless. We're caught at the front line of something larger. But I don't do this for some greater good. We either face it, or fall to it. I wish I could claim to be someone better. Suffering hell to save us all. But I simply want to live another day, just like everyone else. And you willingly brought us I into this mess. This. this guy's I jerk. A choice. I could run and spend the rest of my days in fear. Or I could learn to face it and keep some semblance of a normal life. Normal. Right. It's not a life I would want for anyone. But choosing between a life of fear or control. Bye, fears. Thanks for joining us. Hell and survive. So I'm offering you a different- Sorry for the nightmares! Work the night shift. Learn what I know. Give yourself a chance at a life beyond fear. I don't know what you experienced, but I know it uses the worst parts of you against yourself. The more you experience, the more you'll confront the darkest parts of your life. But through it, you'll become unbreakable. I'm offering the tools to take control. The choice is yours. I hope you come back. Dude, no, I'm not coming back. Hey, <laughs> I, I got the I survived. Oh my god, ending one of five. There are five endings. Oh. So thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, go ahead and leave a like and subscribe for future Phasmophobia content. If you'd like to join in on the fun with chat, you can catch us over at twitch.tv slash amberwix every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. For specific times, you can go ahead and check the description below. And if you'd like to see more endings of this game, go ahead and let me know down in the comments below. I'd also like to give a huge shout out to my patrons. Thank you guys so much for your continued support. It means absolutely everything, and I could not be doing this without you. Happy hunting out there, everyone!